Hey, what is up guys? Welcome back to the channel. My name is Rake and in this video we're going to start a, a new Let's Play series. So this is going to be episode 1 of the 1.18 Let's Play series. It's pretty much just a snapshot for 1.18. So we've got the big caves all done up, all looking nice. And we've also got the mountain. So it's like the caves and uh, cliffs update. So hopefully we're going to have a lot of fun, which I think we will. So let's make sure we got everything good. So I'm going to play on survival and not on hardcore because I don't want to die and then we finish the series because this series is going to be a 10 episode long series. So by the end of this, we're going to defeat the Ender Dragon. So it's kind of like one of those 100 days, but in like 10 episodes instead. So on hard difficulty, uh, game rules. Oh, we don't want to change any of those. Um, more world options. Uh, yeah, let's not put a seed in. All right, let's uh, create this world and see where we spawn. All right, so we have spawned into the world. Um, where are we? So we've got a plains over there. Oh, we've got a spruce biome here. Can I get up onto here? Oh, look at that. Wow, we spawned right next to a pool. All right, let's go check this out quickly. Ouch, don't want to take too much damage. Not at the start because we don't have any food. There might be some golden apples or... Oh, well, there's one golden apple. I meant to say golden carrot, but that'll do. <laughs> I'm pretty happy with that. Get that obsidian and the golden hoe. There we go. Uh, there is no gold block though. There is a bunch of berries, which is a very good food source for the start. Anything else around here? Oh, there's a azalea trees. I did not know they were actually in this update. Um, anything else? We've got a notion here. we got, oh, a giant tiger over there. We could go check that out. And we have the plains over on this side. All right, so I'm going to grab a bit of wood just to get started here. Um, I don't see anything else. There is a little cave over there though, so we could go check that out and see if we can find any iron or even some coal would be nice. So I'm going to chop down this tree, craft up a few tools, and then we're going to head over to there. Alright, so we got to this cave here, which looks pretty nice. Oh, and it also goes here. But it looks like the mountains are over there, so let's go check those out actually before we start mining, just to see how cool these look. See if the generation looks a little bit better than before, which it seems like it does. Those mountains look really cool. They actually look like proper mountains now, look at that. Nice trees as well, all the way up there. Oh, I can't wait to see like a snowy one as well. Alright, let's go and get some iron and some cobblestone, or maybe not even any iron, we might not find any. What is this? Is this a cave? So there's a cave here. Anything in here? Uh, doesn't go far here. I don't know how like what the spawn rates are or like the spawn levels of the ores are on this now because what are we here? We are at 115 height. Uh, no, 63 height still. But oh, I think it goes to like minus 30 now. So it might be a bit harder to find some iron. Okay, so I've got some tools, but as you can tell, I don't have a lot of hunger left. So hopefully uh, we can find a village over here that is uh, the, the best thing that could happen to us hopefully we can because i'm running very low on food right now uh what is this is it just salt oh no there you go it's just sandstone i was gonna say soul sand but that is sandstone uh over here anything hmm there is those azalea trees i'm gonna grab all of the sugar cane as well because it is very annoying to get sugar cane when you want to enchant and you don't have it so what is this loads of gravel Hmm. Can't see very well though underwater, I noticed. Wait, is that a big azalea tree or is it like on a hill or something? Hang on, that looks weird. I think it's something uh, that I messed up with the generation. So let's go check that out quickly. Alright, so yeah, I think <laughs> the generation has messed up a bit here. There is an azalea tree on top of the spruce tree. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, I think it messed up probably because... Wait, is that a ravine? Probably because of it's a, a snapshot, so it's not officially like out yet. So there will be a few little bugs in the game, and there is a lot of these berry bushes I've noticed. Uh, I think we need to get out of this forest though, because I cannot see a thing. So we got a notion over here as well. So it looks like there's oceans surrounding like the whole island here. There is a sunken ship over there. Oh, we can go check that out. It might give us some early diamonds or early iron, which would be fantastic. Oh, look at that. Look at all that iron. Oh, that is fantastic. I can't grab it. Go on. There we go. All of it. There we go. Oh, wow. That is a lot of iron. Let's get out of here quickly. There we go. All right. So I got a bunch of wheat. I got a bunch. Well, not a bunch. I got a buried treasure map, which we should, actually we can check out. And a bunch of iron ingots. So buried treasure map. So when you go south. All right. Where is south? That way. Oh, so you're going to tell me it's just over here? It can't be. It's probably over there. Oh, it actually is. It's very close by. All right, let's try to find this treasure. 
All right, so we're pretty much there. It looks like it's on the other side of this island here. So just over here somewhere, a bit to the left, near this hole, it looks like. Wait, is it just like here? I did not know it could be like this far inland. Uh, there we go. So it should be right here. All right, um, let's grab our crafting table. We're going we're gonna to make a shovel because if not, it's going to take forever to find this. There we go. Stone shovel. All right, so now let's try to find it. Actually, let's use that trick that I have. So what you want to do is go to... Where is the numbers? Okay, right, so on the chunk there, what you want to do is go to 9... I think this will be hit right here. So if I dig right down... Yep, there we go. So as you can see on the chunk, it says 9139. What you want to do is line up the, the two furthest numbers. So 9 and 9. They both need to be at 9. And then you'll end up right on top of the buried treasure. Oh, look, we've got a bunch of food. Not, no, no diamonds, though, unfortunately, but we've got a bunch more iron. Look at that. That is very, very good. All right, let's get out of here and try to find somewhere where we're going to live. Okay, so it's getting nighttime, so hopefully we don't die because I haven't seen any sheep yet to make a bed. Ouch, ouch. And hopefully I don't die to these berries either. Um, yeah, I can't find anything else apart from this forest here. So, And I keep running into these berry bushes as well, so they keep scaring me. Uh, is there anything around here? Let's get out of these leaves. Alright, what we're going to do, there's a skeleton right next to me, so I'm going to craft a shield very quickly. There we go. Equip that. Alright, I'm going to have to take care of this skeleton, I think. Um, anything around here? I don't think there is. I think we might actually live in this uh, biome here. I keep forgetting the name of it, though. There isn't a lot of animals nearby either. Oh, there's this. Oh, I see me. Ouch, I keep running into that. Let me eat this salmon quickly because we're about to have our first mob fight, I think. Are we? Or do you lose me? Are you there, Mr. Baby Zombie? Nope, I think we're good. I think we're good. Alright, well, actually, I might go in the water just to be safe. Is that iron right there? It is. Okay, we're going to have to get rid of these guys. I didn't get that iron. God, die! There we go. We got them all. No zombies nearby. Am I safe? All right, let's get this iron here. Hopefully there's a bit more than this. All right, never mind. All right, well, let's get this coal. We're going to need the coal, and then I'm going to head up into a boat because I don't want to die over here. I just noticed, guys, look at this. It's that really rare birch biome right next to a giant tiger. That's probably uh, not very common. I, I never actually see these. I think I've seen it once before, and it was on a live stream. So, yeah, there's pretty rare biome right here. Oh, wow, look at that. There's a ship right, just on the land over there. I wish I could get to this, but there's a bunch of mobs in the way. Uh, yeah, I don't think I... Ah! Uh, spider almost hit me there. Um, yeah, I'm not going to go to that just yet. I'm just trying to find like a nice little area to live, to be honest. There's a bit of light there, which I have no idea what that can be. Is that a portal under there? I can't really see. It's too dark. I don't know what this is. Oh, there's... Oh, no! Don't hit me, please. All right, let's get away from him, because if not, we're going to die. Alright, so I found some more land over here. Is that an azalea tree or just a oak one? I can't really see. Oh, there's some sheep. Oh, and there's some ice. Is that ice? Oh, it is. It is. Okay. Oh, we got a nice spike right here. Okay, we're like probably a hundred blocks that way is all the other biomes that we were just at. So now we've got a nice spike right here. That is amazing. Alright, I kind of want to get them sheep and hopefully we don't die in them. Okay, please don't kill me, Mr. Zombie. Please don't. Oh, I need to get the sheep. There we go. One. There's a creeper there sneaking up on me, I saw. There we go. All right, we got everything. All right, let's head out of here. There we go. Jump on a boat. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're good. All right, let's see if we can find a nice little area to live. So we've got the ice spike right here. We've got the other biomes just that way. They're on the east from us. And what's this? Just a desert? Oh, there's one of those, uh, what are they called? Drown village? I don't know what they're actually called. Uh, what's over here? Is that a villager? Oh, it is. It's a zombie villager. Look at that. Oh, that ice spike kind of looks really cool. All right, so I made it back to the spruce or the giant tiger biome. What's it? What is it actually called? Ouch. Took a bit of damage there. Um, giant tree tiger. All right, yeah, so let's call it the giant tiger biome. And ow, these guys are annoying. Oh, what's that? Is that like a ravine? Oh, that's pretty cool. Okay, so yeah, I, I've made it back here, and I'm thinking that I might actually build in this biome. Because I've never actually built a house in this biome. 
or yeah nothing at all really i've never really survived in this environment before so i think it could be nice we can i've got a few ideas of what we can build here i just need to find a perfect one so this is like a little island here it's pretty big but it's not too big so maybe you can do something with this and i notice there is two more over here i think there's another azalea tree stuck on the thing over there i can't zoom in because i don't have optifine because it's not out for this snapshot so anything else we can go check i don't want to be too close to like the grayish area like this i don't think it looks very nice this river's pretty cool though hmm we could do something nice around here we we'll have to think we'll have to think anything else uh let's go check over there and then uh, if not we'll just go back here and live in the middle of this one all right so this is uh, a different island and i'm kind of liking this area here i can build like some sort of port or something i think it would be very very nice so for now it's looking like we're going to live here anything else around here i haven't checked out this area it looks like it's like quite a nice little hill as well just here we have to cut down some of these trees of course because if not we're going to struggle a lot here to build uh there is a cave which is nice as well i haven't seen too many caves there is a skeleton in there though so we're not going to go there right now uh there's another cave here what about up here okay ouch i keep taking damage so yeah okay look at this hill this looks so cool it just dips down we're on the top of the hill oh i kind of want to build up here now i think that'd be really cool uh what is that that's like a ravine or something we have to go check that out well actually yeah guys i think we might live on the top of this mountain here i think that might be the plan all right well well for now we're gonna put all our stuff down up here we're gonna call this base camp and then we'll have this barn right next to us as well so it still will be nice uh yeah i think that's what we're gonna do all right i'm gonna place down all my stuff here and then we're gonna go down and check that ravine thing over there oh what is this okay this looks like it's gonna be pretty cool let's go over here i think we've got like a gigantic cave underneath us what is this oh my goodness look at this guys oh this is huge we could like potentially live in a cave as well all right, let's uh, go a bit more over here. Let's see. Can we go down a little bit? Is this going to lead us to where we want it to go? It doesn't look like it. Okay. Yeah, I want to go down a little bit. So let's just go in this water here. There's a little water pool. Can we jump into that? What goes down there as well? Yeah, right here. There we go. All right. There we go. There might be some axolotls as well that spawn here. Oh, let's get down a little bit. There we go. All right. Okay. Yeah, this looks cool. This cave does look very, very cool. All right, I got an idea. We could uh, potentially build a. Can't zoom in. That's a problem there. Yeah, we could build a starter house up top, and uh, then you guys can let me know in the comments uh, where you would like us to build. I got a feeling most of them are going to be in this cave because it's actually a really cool cave. Yeah, I'm liking this cave a lot. It's very deep as well. All right, yeah, I think we might have to live in this. But for now, we're going to build a starter house because we're going to need a bunch of resources anyway. So we can live on the top of the hill. And then uh, we'll be able to see it from afar as well if we build on top of that hill. I want to check this out. Is there going to be an axolotl in here? Axolotls anywhere? Not over there. All right, I can't, we can't go too deep because we don't have anything to survive underwater with. I don't have any doors or anything on me. I'm hoping to actually find some axolotls though. Because I really do love them, um, them mobs. But for now, is there anything over here? So this is the weird ravine that we could see from the top. Does it go down? Like, what is this? Oh, there's a glow squid over there. Look at that. Look at that guy. All right, so it's a ravine. It looks like just like a normal ravine, but that is cutting through the land here and through the water as well. So let's jump in here. Anything down here? All right, so just a glow squid. No axolotls. Oh, it doesn't look like it. Okay. Um, yeah, I think we're going to head home. We're going to get some stuff uh, together here. We're going to get a bunch of wood and we're going to build our first house. All right, so yeah, I'm going to do a bit of mining uh, because we're going to need a bunch of stone for our build because I want to mix in some stone and some wood. So yeah, I'm going to just do some strip mining. I'm not going to go caving because if I do that, then I'm not going to get any stone at all, just ores. But I'm going to grab all the ores that I find as well on the way there because I'm going to need some torches as well. So we're going to need a bunch of coal, iron, and hopefully we can find some diamonds as well. Okay, so we've got some lapis. What level are we? So level 34, you find lapis. I did not know that. Um, we're going to need our iron pick for this. 
I guess it's very good that actually we get some lapis early on. So then we don't have to worry for when we do some enchanting actually. So that's very, very good. I'm going to swap back to my stone pickaxe and hopefully we can find St. Cool. Oh, I can hear loads of water. So maybe... What is this? A big cave? Whoa, okay. So we've got a mine shaft here. Let's get rid of this guy though first. Okay, this is a very big cave. Go away, Mr. Zombie. There we go. All right, let's light this up a little bit. Skeleton over there. Can't really see much. Uh, I can barely see just like you guys just saying. Um, let me add some dirt here so that we know this is the way back. Another one, there we go. And a torch on top. Okay. Got some iron here. A fish. Okay, so we've got a random fish here. Do you come through here? No, let's get rid of that water there. There we go. Oh, the fish uh, died. Whoops. Wasn't my fault. Is that another fish? It is. I can barely see. Okay, what the hell? Look at all the fishies. There's fishes everywhere. No diamonds, though. I was hoping to find some diamonds. Let's block that off. There we go. Alright, uh, so yeah, we've got a mine shaft over here, which is pretty awesome. Uh, a few cod as well. Which actually, we could probably kill so we get some more food. Ow. Stop shooting me. This is going to be another mob fight. There we go. There we go. And there. Gone. I'm trying to get these fishies. I can't. They're just running away from me. Uh, let's close off this water source here and then we should be good. Oh, there's another one dying over here. I love your flesh. Thank you very much. There we go. And one more. Ah, oh, that's so hard to hit. Do I have my other axe? Yes, I do. Okay, good. Got five for now. Where'd the other guy die? Wait, what? I swear there was another one over here. Oh, some more zombies. I might have to turn up the brightness in my editing here so you guys can actually see. Get rid of these zombies. There we go. Oh, my health is not looking too good. So let's have some bread. What is that over there then? Alright, so another huge cave. Uh, there's some gold. I'm trying to find some diamonds. Yeah, I can hear another cave. So hopefully it's a big one. Uh, well, not a huge one because I... Oh, oh, there it is. Is it? Oh, it looks like a big one. Oh, I don't want to get shot. I hear a skeleton. Where are you? Uh, let's go up here first. Clear the top part. Hopefully there's no one on top of us. Um, seems kind of clear. Anyone over here? No, all right, we're good. All right, let's go down uh, lower, though, because I don't want to be high up. Because I don't know what level diamond spawn, but I'm guessing it's a bit lower. Oh, there's a guy there. I can hear a few of these skeletons. There's one there. All right, this is going to be a bit of a problem trying to kill these two guys. I've got no armor. Oh, there's two more over there. Oh, my goodness. All right, um, shoot yourself. Oh, there we go. Perfect. All right. Now we can get down here. There we go. Okay. There you go. That's that one as well. Right, let's go deal with this guy over here. Come here, mister. There we go. Okay. All right, fantastic. Let's light this area up a little bit. These caves are huge. They look so cool now. I'm so happy to play to be playing this snapshot. Oh. Ouch. All right, one of you shoot each other. There we go. All right, good. Perfect. <laughs> All right, let's let those guys fight. And what's that? So we've got some redstone here. Anything of it? Oh, some gold. Nice. Anything else? Oh, oh, hello, mister. I didn't mean to come and intrude. There we go. And one more hit. All right, nice. Okay, got rid of that one as well. Oh, I heard... I can hear some animal over here to my right. Oh, diamonds! Oh, no, creeper! No! Come back here. Come over here. I think I heard an axolotl as well, maybe. Oh, run away. And hit. There we go. All right, perfect. Yeah, I think I heard an axolotl as well. That would be so cool. If we can find an axolotl and some diamonds in the same area. Oh, there's a hole down here. This guy saw me, though. There we go. And one more hit. All right, nice. All right, let's go check out those diamonds quickly. Need to light everything up here. No one can come from up there. Okay. Uh, there are the diamonds. Let's uh, light up over here. And here. All right. Fantastic. All right. Let's mine these diamonds now. See how many we got. All right. So. Um, okay. There's two. Okay. That's not looking too good. So one. And two. Okay. It looks like we only got two. 
but um, I'm pretty happy with that, especially for the first episode. I wasn't really planning on actually getting diamonds, but... Oh, and some gold, nice. But yeah, I'm pretty happy with that. So we've got two diamonds. Maybe we can find some more because we haven't explored the rest of the cave either, so... I kind of want to go check out those sounds that I heard in the water as well. Because if it's an axolotl, that would be so cool. Oh, there's another dead fish right there. And there is a lot of zombies, so is there a spawner maybe? It'd be cool if we could find a spawner, but we wouldn't be able to really use it because it's so deep underground. There we go, get rid of these guys. Go on, go away, mister. And what about you over there? Why can you not, like, walk around like a normal zombie? There's a skeleton over there, there. Did you try to shoot me? I did. I've got no armor, I keep forgetting, so it does a lot of damage. There we go. Oh, and now a zombie with a shovel, so we need to get rid of him quickly. Before he hits us. There we go. Alright, let's have some food. Try to get some health back up. Alright, good. Anything around here, please? Maybe some more diamonds? Be nice. Anything? There's not a lot of ores, I noticed. It seems like it's going to be a lot harder to actually find some ores. Alright, so we've got a lava pool over there. Oh, more diamonds. Oh, there's a lot of skeletons over there, though. Okay, need you guys to fight. There we go. Alright, there. Yeah, perfect. They're fighting. Alright, let's light this up now. What is happening? Who's fighting who? Go away. And you. Come here. Fight me. There we go. Alright, let's light all of this up though quickly. Oh my goodness. Yeah, there's no ores. It seems like there's a lot less ores in this update. Alright, let's go check over here and see how many diamonds there is. Alright. Where are the diamonds? Here they are. Okay. So we got... Oh, that was uh, close. Almost fell through. Oh, is it just going to be one diamond? <laughs> oh, we're unlucky with our diamonds on this one. But I guess at least we got three now. So we got enough to make a pickaxe. Okay, yeah, it doesn't seem like there's any more diamonds or anything around here. So I think we'll go uh, home and we're going to start on building our starter house. Okay, so there is a drowned waiting for me at the top of the stairs here. Uh, go away, mister. Well, I'm happy it's not a guy with a trident. And um, the problem is, though, we're going to have to do quite a bit of a run here to get back home. So hopefully there isn't too many mobs out here. I'm hoping, anyway. All right, let's do a little run for it and hopefully we get to bed safely. All right, so unfortunately in the next few clips, uh, my audio just done a few backflips for some reason. So I pretty much just went home and started on... A constructing pretty much a farm because I was running out of food. I only had like four pieces of bread left. So I decided to do a bit of wheat uh, and then later on we'd fill it up with potatoes and all that if we actually found some, which is uh, what I was hoping for. And after that, I pretty much just done some terraforming to get ready to build the house. So I needed quite a bit of room because I was going to make quite a decent sized house. So I was uh, looking forward to building this. But I had to go and get a bunch of resources as well. But luckily, we had some giant tiger trees right next to us. So that was pretty easy to get some wood. Okay, so after that little time lapse, I decided that I wanted to build with white concrete. So I needed to go and get some sand. So I found this little island and right after I got up on this island, I realized that there was a village right next to our house because this is the village right here and our house is pretty much just on the opposite uh, island over there. So right at the top of there where I'm aiming right now, that is where our house is. 
So I collected a bit of sand, just enough to be able to start on getting some white concrete. And after that, I pretty much just went and looted the whole village. I didn't really find much, just a few emeralds and I also did find some potato which would be very very good because I was looking forward to getting some potatoes because as you guys all know uh, potatoes are pretty much like one of the fastest crops to grow in my opinion anyway and uh, yeah so I was pretty pleased with that uh, so I looted the rest of the village didn't find much apart from another iron pickaxe which was pretty awesome and I did also collect a few trapdoors on the way out after that I went home and tried to pillow her up and jump down but fortunately I did die. I missed the water source which I thought was quite funny. So yeah after that I had to run back home because I forgot that I slept in the village and uh, yeah that was pretty annoying. So I had to chop down the trees and make another boat and then go home. And after that very embarrassing death, uh, I started on building the rest of the house. So I was using white concrete and I thought it turned out really nice. I was very pleased with the white concrete and I wanted some like windows at the front here. Then I was going to do a different roof than I usually do. And yeah, I think it did turn out pretty nice. So here's a little update. So as you can tell, I didn't manage to patch up that little area because the chests were in the way and I didn't want to break them. So I did put a bunch of stone and andesite in the back on the bottom side. And I thought it looked really nice. I also done some little arches with the stairs or the upside down stairs. I thought it turned out really nice as well. So now what I was going to do is add a bit more detail. So I was going to craft a few more stairs and some slabs and all that just to make it look a little bit nicer. So here's another little update. So I managed to add a little window there and these like diagonal, I don't know what you call these, but I've seen them in like some actual real pictures of houses and I think it looks really nice. So I was pretty pleased with how I done it because I didn't have a lot of room as it was a two block wide gap. But I also added some trapdoors underneath and I wasn't too sure with what to do with this area here. So I thought maybe like add some trapdoors or something just to hide it. But yeah, I was pretty pleased with this. So I added some trapdoors on the left side and then some uh, slabs on the right side. And yeah, I was very, very pleased with it. I also finished up the roof, so I added some trapdoors on the top of it. And I used some blackstone slabs, I think they're called. No, not slabs, slates. I can't remember what they're called. But I thought they were really... Oh, tiles, that's it. Blackstone tiles. And I was really pleased with those because they actually turned out really nice. But uh, after this clip, by the way, guys, we're back to normal. And uh, luckily, the audio works. Alright, so guys, since the last clip, unfortunately I got quite a bit ill, so that might be why my voice has changed. But yeah, as you can tell, I have finished the roof, and... Okay. Well, that's a bit of a problem. I <laughs> don't know what these guys are doing here. It's only like the third day or something. But anyway, I wanted to put a chimney probably on this side of the roof. Oh, I keep getting stuck. I try to add a bit of decoration as well. But yeah, I want to add a chimney on this side of the, of the roof. So I'm going to go up. I've got a few bricks already and uh, they're taking forever to smell. Uh, but luckily I found a massive uh, clay pocket. But yeah, so I kind of want to do it. Should I start here? Is that going to be in a good spot, do you think? I think it will be. So we're going to go up like this. Uh, going to go up. I don't know how far. Oh, we need some uh, campfires actually as well. So I want to add a bit of detail into it as well. So I'm going to do some granite. There we go. Then go up again. There we go. All the way to the top. Uh, I think that most probably do actually height wise. So I'm going to do that actually. And I'm going to break this one as well. And I'm going to add some stairs. So I need to go craft some stairs and some campfires. Okay, so we have everything. But what I'm going to do is actually drop this down here. Break all of this. There we go. There we go. And now, actually, should we break this layer? Yeah, I think I'm going to do it on this layer. So I'm going to put the granite on this layer here. And we collect all the blocks, though, because we need all of them back. So granite. There we go. Uh, well, actually, no. I think we're going to have to do this. I wanted to put some fences, but that's not going to work. Unless I do it, like, only in some corners. So like that. And then if I break this and put fence here. Well, not a fence, a wall. That's just going to look weird, isn't it? Yeah, that's just going to look weird. Alright, so now we're going to break this for now. Uh, we're going to place an uh, actual full block there. And another one over here. Oh, that went flying for some reason. There we go. Uh, now I need to climb up. So, here. Two. Oh, can't get to the top. Let's break that. Now place this. And to do an upside down stair, I think I'm just going to go like this. Uh, this is going to be the front, so do that. Break this. Upside down stair. Go over here. There we go. And then we can add our campfires. 
There we go. Jump off. Oh. Okay, and then we just add some, like, um, trapdoors, I think. And what we could do, actually, is add another layer of granite. I think we'll, we can put it up here. So let's do that. Some more granite. There we go. Just a bit more detail. There we go. And another bit there. All right. Well, let me go sleep quickly, and we'll add some trapdoors, and we'll see how it turns out. All right. Well, I want to look at the chimney from far away, but it looks like we're going to have to get rid of these guys first. Oh, did they see me? So they look at you from far away, but they don't attack you? What's happening? Where's the banner guy? There we go. Get rid of all these. Oh. It's a bit hard because I don't have armor, so I don't want to take too much damage. There we go. All right, perfect. I don't know where the banner guy is, but I did see him. Well, maybe he just ran off or fell into a cave or something. Hmm. All right, well, what does this look like? Uh, yeah, I'm kind of liking it. It might need to be a bit lower, actually. It seems a bit high, so I'll probably change that off camera. But for now, though, I think what we can do is go check out that cave. I really want to go see what is in that cave. So let's head over here. I think that is where it is, isn't it? Uh, yeah, I think it's right here. All right, I've got some water on me as well so that we can, like, scale off the walls and go down. And also a bunch of torches. So hopefully we can light up a good area. I saw that there was a bunch of mobs down there earlier, so hopefully there's not too many now. Oh, I say that. First mob I see is a creeper. Great. <laughs> Alright, so. How do we get down from here? Uh, probably down here. There is a creeper, so we have to watch out. This looks so cool. Look at this, guys. Oh, I wish there w it was a lush cave. Imagine if this was a lush cave. It'd look amazing. Alright, Mr. Creeper. Oh, there's a skeleton. No. You're going to shoot the creeper? Oh, that was a bit rude. You're shooting the creeper, man. Oh, and again. God, give me a disc. Nice. Thank you. Oh, there we go. And he's gone. What did he give me? I, I have no idea what this disc is. Oh, this is so cool. Wait, is this like another ravine? Oh, it is. Look at that. Oh, there's a skeleton net. Oh, run away. We need to get, get some healing going. Alright, this is going to be quite tough, considering we don't have... Oh, he shot the creeper towards me. I need to escape. Ah, He's not going to follow me because it's in the sunlight. There we go. They're both gone. Anything else over here? We need to get rid of this guy. There we go. And he's gone. Oh, he gave me a bow. Oh, that is fantastic. There's a zombie coming now. There's so many mobs in here. There we go. And he's gone as well. Alright, let's uh, speed run this. Try to light up as much as we can. There we go. A bit more. Oh, this is so cool, this cave. Oh, and it leads all the way over to here. Oh, there's a lot of creepers. Alright. <laughs> well, it doesn't look like there's much in here. It doesn't look like it leads to anywhere else. Apart from maybe... In this ravine. Oh, I'm scared here. Oh, I'm. S this ain't good. This isn't good. I need to run away. Run away, run away. Oh, some. Is that a spider? Please look, hit me, Mr. Spider. I think we're good. What is that? Oh, it's him. Oh, God. Another spider just jumped off the cliff to try to attack me. All right. Well, it doesn't look like there is much here anyway. So I think we're going to head home. Uh, yeah, we're going to head home. That's for sure. <laughs> we're getting chased by mobs. We need to get some armor going as well for the next episode. Because right now, this isn't uh, too good. Especially with these big caves that you can't even light up properly. Oh, and there's a normal little cave. Alright, yeah, I'm going to head home. And I think we're going to end off the episode. So, anyway, guys. I am trying to reach 100,000 subscribers. So, if you did enjoy that video, don't forget to uh, leave a little subscribe. Um, but anyway, yeah. I, I hope you guys did enjoy the video. And uh, I'll be seeing you in the next one. Peace.